we're about to visit two of those old friends from dad's cooking school. Both Kim Marquez and Albert Raurik are well-known chefs here in Barcelona. And they're hosting us at Kim's house. Hola. Kim, Kim, Kim. Hola. Albert, ¿qué has traído? What is your plan? Un poco de todo. Okay, vamos a ponerlo aquí. A ver. We bought things, we bought things. Con la boquería. Mira, 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 mira. Oh, nice. Boom. Wait, but so we have all these ingredients. What are we cooking? Mar y montaña. Surf and turf. This is your typical mar y montaña. Puyastra ames cabarlans. Chicken with Mediterranean lobster. You'll find this Catalan combination on menus across the region. After quickly cooking the lobsters in brandy, we sear the chicken pieces in the same pan, using the use of the lobsters. Then we add onions and garlic and tomatoes and let it simmer. Eventually, we put in some herbs like thyme, rosemary, bay leaf and oregano, as well as something unusual. Un poquito de canela. Cinnamon. Poquito. Cinnamon. Para perfume, para... Esta Ufor. cocina que tenemos aquí en, en el Mediterráneo, que es un poquito francesa, que nos baja para aquí estas costumbres. Are you good there? Well, oh, we're, we're phenomenal we're, here. Uh, we're sipping on yeah, wine. But, we're, but, we have three amazing chefs cooking for us. I, no. <laughs> I mean, uh, they're my assistants right now. Oh, I'm sure. Oh. I think it's the other way around. Uh oh, he's running the ice. <laughs> These guys are like brothers to me. And thanks to our passion for food, we'll always share a unique connection. We are joined by this umbilical cord that is never been cut yeah. to the mother that brought us together, which is cooking. But dad told me that he rarely ever went to school. No. In the classroom, no, on the, in the kitchen. In the kitchen. Always. He will come down to look for me in the kitchen. Hey, the teacher many, is calling many, you. Many times. <laughs> <laughs> we are going to put Ines to work making the picada. It's a traditional Catalan burst of flavor that we'll add to the dish at the end. There is garlic, almonds, peppers, and a little bit of chocolate in ours. Everything is smashed, becomes like a total puree. And when everything is finished, this will go at the end to bring everything together. At the same time that adds new flavor, also gives body to the sauce. Super traditional sauce of sauces. Okay, not too much, not too much. You know what's happening here. What is happening here is happiness. What you hear there is happening. It's the happiness of all the ingredients saying, chup, 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 I'm so happy, chup, 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 I'm so happy, chup, 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 I am happy. Chup, chup, chup. That's what's happening. No more wine. No more wine. Fantastic. Okay, let's eat. We are very lucky. Very lucky people. Freestyle. That looks delicious. My wow. Wow. First, mar or montaña? This is the conundrum of life, and the answer can only be found on your own <laughs> by you. You're getting too deep, so. <laughs> Listen to the chicken. So mine is telling But the way you don't eat the chicken is with your fingers. What do you think this is? Kentucky Fried Chicken? <laughs> <laughs> but it's so good. A traditional dish invented by local fishermen and farmers that we still love and enjoy today. I mean, there's no better way to start a visit to Catalonia, a visit to Barcelona. Hey, I love you guys. <laughs> Me too. To all of you.